Welcome to February's Leco Challenge. Today's problem is validate stack sequences. Given two sequences pushed and popped with distinct values, return true if and only if this could have been the result of a sequence of push and pop operations on an initially empty stack. So we have our pushed list and our popped list, and this kind of imitates what's getting pushed. This will be in order, and this will be what we pop off. So to solve this, why don't we just create a stack and simulate this push and pop? What we can do is uh, start off by adding to our stack. And if we'll have a pointer at the first element on popped, if these two are equal to one another, since they're distinct, we know that we can pop them off the stack because that's what was going on. Um, otherwise, we just continue our loop and we'll uh, see at the very end if our stack is empty. If it is, we know that we could simulate this process. So what we'll do is create a stack here. Uh, we'll also initialize our n equals length of popped. Uh, this should be the same, but i equals 0. That's going to be the pointer on popped. So for um, p in popped, oh, not popped, pushed, what will we do? Let's first add to our stack. Now if, or I should say while, there's a stack and, um, let's see, while there's a stack and i is less than n because we got to make sure we're in bounds and the stack the very last one is equal to whatever is on popped i if this is the case then we can move our i pointer ahead uh, and we can also pop off our stack here and we don't need to keep track of that uh, make sure to Continue that, and really at the end, we just check to see if our stack is empty. Is stack equal to an empty? If that is, then this means that we could do this. So let's see if this works. Okay, that looks like it's working, so let's submit it. And there we go, accepted. It's always nice when you come up with a solution and it looks exactly like the solution they give you. Um, this isn't too difficult. It's going to be O of n time and O of n space. Um, is there a way to do it without having that temporary stack? Don't know, but but this seems to work. Um, so definitely don't overcomplicate it. Uh, this should work. Yeah. Thanks for watching my channel. Remember, do not trust me. I know nothing.